Hi reception and welcome back to another drawing lesson. Today we are going to be focusing on making sure that we are colouring in real sections of each of the drawing. What you're going to need for today's session is a blank piece of paper, your drawing pencil and maybe an eraser if it gets a bit tricky. Then you are going to need markers to outline, don't colour in with markers, and pencils to colour in. Remember today we are focusing on our colouring in to make sure that we are filling the shapes sensibly and that we're not rushing through our work. So if you want to draw the whole thing and then colour it in in stages later, that's fine. But today's aim and focus is to make sure we are colouring in our drawings beautifully. Let's get started. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to start our art now. Remember, when you are drawing, you need to start with your drawing pencil, okay? We're going to draw a fish today. Now, a fish has got a really cool shape. It's kind of like a bubble, like a balloon. So you go one that way, okay? Actually, already made a little bit of a mistake. So let me just take that away. It's like a balloon. I forgot to do the little tiny bit like that. Here we go. That's a bit better. So if you make a mistake, don't worry, it's absolutely fine. You just use your eraser to take it away. Then you go that way, do exactly the same thing, and back up and around. Okay, now I've done it again, so I'm just going to make it, there you go, a bit neater. Okay, so once you've done that shape, you're then going to do the tail which is, goes up like that, and then down like that with like a little curve at the end. See my little curve? Little curve. And then it goes down, oh, and I had to pick up my pencil to make sure I got all the way down there. Okay, so once you've done that bit, we are going to cut, oh, sorry, not cut, outline the face so that's going to be my fish's face okay yes and i'm going to do an eye so we've got a circle and then this circle inside and that kind of touches the white the bigger circle and i've got a happy fish so i'm going to give him a smile it's a happy fish happy fish yes and then i'm going to do the fin on top just like that and then curl that line in and down and around and down it's like a, a wishy-washy line you see oh and down there you go okay i'm gonna do two little fins here do you remember when we did the teardrop shape for the lion, same thing, teardrop, teardrop, well done, and we've got one more little line like that. Now we're going to start adding the details. The details are what gonna, it's going to help us make sure that we are colouring in sensibly in all the right areas, okay? First thing I'm going to do is the tail, make like a V that's sitting on the side, okay? And then you've got one, two, three, four, and I'm actually going to take those lines all the way to the end of the tail. Oh. Yeah, there you go. And same thing over here, just some lines to help with details. And you can do it all the way to the edge if you would like or not. It's up to you, this is your fish. Okay, in there. Oh, same thing up here, one, two, three. Gives it some movement. I'm absolutely going to make them go until there because I'm going to colour all those in. 
Okay, and then I'm going to do these little half moon shapes that are going to make the scales. Now this is the important part of today's activity because these are the scales that we are going to colour in individually. This is where we're going to practice how not to scribble. We're going to make sure that we're colouring in beautifully using all sorts of colours. Okay, so please make sure you get lots of scales in so that you can do lots of beautiful practice. I'm going to get the scales to go all the way until the end. Because I really want to make sure I'm practicing my colouring in. Oh. There you go. Okay. So that is our fish. If we sound it out. Can you help me? So now we're going to start colouring in. Now this is what the aim or the goal of this activity is. Okay. I want you to practice, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, monkeys and monsters, colouring in, in a shape. Okay. Working carefully not to go out the lines, but also to make sure that you are correctly filling the shape. So if that's the shape I'm trying to fill, not colouring in like that and saying I'm done. Okay, just going to zoom in a little bit so you can see. Really zoomed in so that you can see the difference. That is not finished yet. Okay, now I'm going to carefully colour it in and show you what, I'm, what we're going to be working on. Okay, so I'm holding my pencil. I'm making small little lines. And I'm working on making sure... I'm not going out the lines. Also trying to make sure I'm not scribbling. It helps if you do little lines. Little lines. Not big lines because then it's a little bit harder to control. So that is a coloured shape. Okay? That's what we're going to be working on today. Making sure that we are colouring in like this. Right, let's get going. you so much for joining in i had so much fun making that beautiful fish and i'm very excited to see how wonderfully you have all colored yours in have a great afternoon and i'll see you soon bye